Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading for Scorpio, the person that is currently on your mind uh, for February 2022. Uh, you could apply this to your sun, moon, rising, Venus signs. So we're going to take a look at your person uh, to see what their current over energies are like, what they've been up to, or what are they up to, uh, and... Um, what their uh, true feelings are towards you and then we'll finish off the read to see what future actions they will take towards you so uh this could be someone that you are currently dealing with or someone that you are separated from and that you're in no contact with apply this to your own unique situation switch the roles if you want um keep in mind uh that these are general messages take what resonates leave the rest behind if this message didn't resonate take a look at your other placements uh if you guys haven't done so yet hit the subscription button and the, and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post give this video a thumbs up like this video so that this message can circulate around to the individuals that need to hear this Share this video with someone if you feel like there's someone out there that you know that needs to hear this. Leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. For those of you guys that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me, the link is in the description box below. All right, Scorpio, let's get started. Uh, tell me about the person that is currently on Scorpio's mind. What are their over energies like? What are they up to? What are their feelings towards Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs for February uh, 10 of Cups and the Four of Swords. Seems like someone here is having a hard time moving on without you. The Lovers and the Ten of Pentacles. I mean, someone here is looking for long-term fulfillment, um, long-term happiness here with you, long-term stability, uh, um, commitment to your loyalty, we have the Wheel of Fortune and the, and the Death card. So this is telling me that there is a separation here, but we have someone here that has a hard time moving on or letting this go, okay? So could be dealing with another Scorpio here. All right, let's see, Ten of Cups. Why is it Ten of Cups here? Uh, Scorpio, Gemini, could be dealing with a Gemini. You might even have Gemini in your chart too, Scorpio. Ten of Cups. Queen of Cups in the reverse here. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. So we have one person that does not want this relationship anymore, okay? Let me get some more messages here. With the Queen of Cups in the reverse, this is telling me that someone here is emotionally not invested in this. Uh, four of Swords, Seven of Cups, this is interesting, The Lovers, Ten of Pentacles, The Sun, you know who wants this? The person that wants this is this king here. Could be dealing with the Capricorn Taurus Virgo. Someone here is confused to why they want this. Because this king of pentacles is a perfect person here, the perfect uh, individual who's loyal, who is committed, okay? who's grounded, who's solid here, who ha is well put together. Um, the wheel in the reverse. 
Nine of Pentacles, Virgo Energy, Queen Empress Energy here, the death in the reverse, and the Two of Swords, okay. Nine of Pentacles, Queen Empress Energy, Virgo Energy, Two of Swords. <coughs> I feel like someone here doesn't want to see that things have ended here. You know, I feel like one person has moved on because I feel like someone here was seeking their independence, their freedom. You know, someone here could have felt smothered or something like that. Like someone here could have, could have felt like someone here was on them, okay? I feel like this, this two of wands in this world is more so this queen of cups' energy because I feel like... There's a bit of like, did I make the right decision here? Let's get one more here. Why is the Queen of Cups in the reverse here? Four of Cups in the reverse. I don't, I feel like this Queen of Cups doesn't want this relationship. So Scorpio, you're someone here who doesn't want this relationship? Could be that you're just not ready for it. Ace of Wands. This is really interesting because I feel like someone here wants a bad boy than a good boy, okay? Someone here who's really, like, sexual, someone here who's really good in bed, you know, someone here who's really adventurous. So I feel like you're maybe straddled between two different types of men here. I mean, we clearly have someone here who is loyal who's committed um not that this king of wands can't be but uh this king of wands is an energy that's a bit all over the place okay it could be very fiery uh it's an energy that's hard to keep up uh especially for you scorpio especially if uh you know uh you know because you know with scorpions with scorpio the, you know there needs to be some sort of consistency and this king of pentacles could offer that you know so seems like he might be straddled between, like I said, two different types of people. All right. Tell me about Scorpio's person that is on their mind. You might have two people on your mind, Scorpio. Okay. Uh, it could be a situation that, you know, maybe those, these two individuals are too overwhelming for you and you've taken a step back here. Um... All right, tell me about the person or the persons uh, that's on Scorpio's mind here. Will this person take any sort of future action towards Scorpio? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for February 2022. You know, it could, I, I feel like everyone, everyone involved here does not want this to end, okay? Or is having a hard time moving on. The sun. Two of swords. Okay. Okay, you have the sun and two of swords. You know, I feel like the answers are right there in front of you, but perhaps with the Two of Swords here, you know, you might have blinders on right now, um, Scorpio. I mean, there are three, it seems like there are three people here, but you could, you know, place yourself where you see fit. All right. We have Judge Justice and the Eight of Pentacles. Libra Energy. And then we have the World in the Reverse and the Eight of Cups. So, I mean, someone here walked away. Someone here is going to come back around. You know, I'm feeling like Scorpio, you could have walked away here. I mean, that Queen of Cups is in the reverse. So, let's see. Tell me about the Sun. Ace of Pentacles, okay. Two of Swords. All right, we have the Empress in the reverse, Libra, Taurus energy. Someone here is just not ready to be in a relationship, okay? 
I just feel like someone here is just focused on their independence, their freedom here, um, their money, uh, their pentacles, uh, justice. Um, you know, I do feel like eventually you might circle back to dating, but right now I just feel like you're not. You just emotionally can't invest. Justice. We have the Devil card. Capricorn energy. Eight of Pentacles. Six of Cups. You know, I do feel like this... So this King of Pentacles is an X here. I do feel like this person's going to try and come back around. Uh, the world's in the reverse. I feel like this person's obsessing over you. This person can't think, of, can't stop thinking about you. But you just don't want anything to do with this person. Or anybody for that matter. Uh, the world. Oh. Seven of Swords in the reverse. So this is someone here just getting away. Trying to protect themselves. Trying to protect their energies here. We have the Hierophant here. Taurus energy with the Eight of Cups. I mean, someone here is going to eventually try again, okay? Because I do, I do feel like this, in the, I, do, I do feel like you perhaps met a soulmate here, but perhaps you're having fun with this individual here right now, okay? <coughs> so, so like I said, there are three people here. Um, I do feel like you're this... Queen of Cups or this Empress here in the reverse, just emotionally not investing into someone here that you have been looking for here um, regarding love. I, I do feel like you walked away from this person to more so focus on yourself. Uh, but I feel like, uh, you know, this king eventually is going to come back or that you're going to go back to this king because right now I, I feel like you might be using this king or kind of playing around with this king right now or having a good time. But, you know, you can switch the roles if you want to place yourself where you see fit, okay? So, um, Scorpio, I hope this was helpful. I hope this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video. Like this video if you haven't done so yet. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I will speak to you guys in the next one. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.